Ну а прямо сейчас наступает главный бой сегодняшнего турнира. В средней весовой категории в синий угол клетки приглашается Гаджи Аваргаджиев, город Москва. You're watching MMA series 20, Time of New Heroes. We are live from St. Petersburg, Russia, and brought to you once again by the Fubo Sports Network and around the world on the Clash TV app. This is the main event of the evening, and this is the one I've really been waiting for. I always like to look at a fight card and, you know, pick a fight that stands out to me, but this time it has been this main event. How can this fail? You've got two unbeaten fighters here now, fighting in the middleweight division. Gadji Omar Gadjiev, 11 wins out of 11 fights. Two of those wins have come by submission, eight of them by big KO. Only been the distance once. This is a phenomenal talent. Someone who's going to make it real on the big stage. As he smiles to the camera there, putting in his gum shield. Again, thanks to Fubo Sports Network, Clash TV for bringing these fights through a worldwide pandemic and the matchups we've seen here again this evening. But this, for me, is going to be the fight of the night. On paper, this is an exceptional fight. These are two fighters you don't expect to see fighting until really late on in the career when they've made it. This is a real test. Who can win? Who is going to keep the unbeaten record? А в красный угол клетки приглашается боец из города Санкт-Петербург. Встречайте, Владимир Васильев! So here we go with our final fighter to make his way down to the cage this evening. Making his way down to the red corner for this middleweight contest, Vladimir Vasilyev. Vasilyev, a veteran of the MMA series. He fought back on MMA series 11. He had a decision win against Ruslan Shamilov. But we saw how good Ruslan Shamilov was earlier on. I said his two fights that he'd lost both by decision. One was to Enoch Solves Torres, who's an unbeaten phenomenal fighter, and another unbeaten phenomenal fighter here in Vladimir Vasiliev. Before that fight going the distance, Vasiliev had fought six other men and not one of them had made it past the second round. Again, this guy is a finishing machine. Both Vasiliev and Omar Gadjev are finishers. This on paper is absolute fireworks. Your main event of the evening, ladies and gentlemen. Дамы и господа, прямо сейчас состоится главный бой вечера, главный бой турнира MMA серия 20. Время новых героев. Представляем вам бойцов главного боя вечера. В синем углу клетки боец из города Москва. Представляет клуб Golden Team, клуб Universal Fights. Ему 27 лет. В его активе 11 побед, ни одного поражения. Встречайте, Гаджи Амарджаев! А противостоять ему будет боец в красном углу клетки из города Санкт-Петербург. Ему 21 год, представляет команду Сеч Про. Его профессиональный рекорд 7 побед, не знающий поражений. Владимир Васильев! Дамы и господа, наступает время новых героев! Рефери в клетке Вячеслав Киселев. На середину. Итак, правила полностью не нарушаем. Работаем три раза по пять минут. Снимая подпущенные команды, защищаем себя на протяжении всего поединка. Стремимся к досрочной победе, уважаем друг друга. Руки вошли! Вон! 
You're watching MMA Series 20, Time of New Heroes. This is the main event of the evening, middleweight contest. Omar Gadjev in the blue, Vasiliev in the red. Two unbeaten stars. Touch of gloves and the action begins. Faints and entered straight into striking exchange there. Not wasting any time. Again, Omar Gadjia fainting, stepping in. Heavy inside low kick from Vasiliev, who's backing away. Faints and pressure. Good footwork here from Omar Gadjiev early on. Vasiliev in the southpaw stance. Omar Gadjiev busy from the orthodox stance back to southpaw and then back to orthodox there. Switching, staying busy, keeping Vasiliev thinking. Again, nice exchange there. High kick attempt there from Vasiliev. Omar Gadjiev keeping working. He comes in with that long straight right to the body, up with the left hook to the head. Switching levels as he presses forward. Overhand right. Again works the body, then the head. It's working for him. He comes down, he comes in low. And then finishes high. Vasiliev stands his ground that time and threw two uppercuts. Nice work there. Both guys working from both stances, switching feet. Be interesting to see if Vladimir Vasiliev stands his ground a little bit more because his best success there was actually when he stood his ground and fired the counters in. And that's what's actually now forced, it forced Omar Gadjiev to start to back off, and then it made him think about changing levels and taking his fight to the floor. He gets the takedown, he's looking to pinch the legs together. Rather than pass to side control, look, he's looking to go back over and lock his legs together. Is he going to settle for half guard here? Yes, he does, locks the legs. Look for him to try and get the head clear now and work for ground and pound from his half-guard position. Vasiliev looking to try to get his hip and his hand to the floor so he can stand up using the fence. Looking to break that body lock. So Omar Gadjev on top now in the full guard of Vladimir Vasiliev. Main event of the evening. MMA Series 20. See so Vasiliev trying to work the hands over to one side. The two-on-one grip on the hands, stopping any work from Omar Gadjev. Now in the half guard on the other side. Will Vasiliev look to get to his hip? He's looking to push off with that hip with the right leg. Looking for the arm triangle. Now this might not get a finish from this position on the bottom, but what he can do is if he can pull away from the fence. So he's there, he tied up the, so he's one way down, triangle, he actually tied up the head and arm, what we call a, a head pinch or pinch headlock, and he was looking to try to work to work a sweep. Because the fence was in the way, the side that he would have wanted to sweep Omar Gadjiev to was actually where the fence is, which stopped the sweep from happening. But now we're in the full guard. Omar Gadjiev dropping down elbows from inside the full guard of Vladimir Vasiliev. 
Again, he looks to work on that hip. Can use that to push away. Oh, my Gadjev looks to pass the legs to land a big strike. That will be the end of the first round. And definitely a round on points to Gadji Omar Gadjev, who was more active in the stand up, much busier. But when Vladimir Vasiliev stood his ground and landed some shots of his own, he took the fight to the floor. But again, dominant from the floor. Here, as we watch the replay, it was the switches from the body up to the head working from Omar Gadjev. On the floor, he worked the ground and pound. Solid positioning. Not looking too much to pass guard, but landing big shots to the body and the head. So a clear first round on my card. So, Gadji, oh my, Gadjev, you look at the strikes there. Nearly double the amount thrown and landed for Omar Gadjev. If you're watching at home on a Clash TV app, please score for your favorite fighter. Make sure you clap, ask any questions. This is the main event of the evening. Vladimir Vasiliev had little moments there of success. Let's see if he can build on those as we go back to the stand-up. Big overhand right there from Omar Gadjev. Vasiliev covering up well and circling off now. And it forces again, forces the level change from Omar Gadjev, who preferred his fight to be on the floor. Passes to side control. Looks to pin the arm into the crucifix. A good position here now for ground and pound. Look how he's got both arms controlled. He'll start to work the strikes in from this position. Difficult defend as Vasiliev circling the hips, looking for the hip switch, looking to try and get an elbow to the floor so he can get out of this position. But well, Trout is circling, he's circling, trying everything he can, and that's a good escape. But Omar Gadjev now switches to the back. Again, controlling the wrist on one arm and looking to strike with the other. Knees to the body now. Vasiliev gets back to his feet or gets at least to one foot. Oh my God, Jeff sees that as an entry for his leg. Gets the leg through, so he's got one hook in and he's hooked it. Great vines round the bottom of the shin. Difficult now for Vasiliev to get him off. It's where he's got the flexibility to straighten that left leg to unhook that grapevine, which he does. Gets back up to his feet and again he's pulled back down. So disheartening, so demoralising when that happens. You get, you're taken down, you manage to drive, get yourself up to your feet and when you do, you're taken straight back down. A question from the Clash TV app. Who has the more work to do to win? It looks quite even. So here, the most work has got to be for Vasiliev because Omar Gadjev was busier in landing the strikes and then he's dictated where the fight goes. They always say in mixed martial arts, it's the good wrestler who decides where the fight goes and he decides, is this fight going to stay standing? Is it going to go to the floor? The wrestling exchanges, the takedowns have been won by Omar Gadjev, who is now inside control, controlling the position from the floor. There's a lot of work here for Vasiliev to do. He needs to get back to his feet. He needs to try to dominate on there. He's used a cage and that's a great reversal. But watch here in the scrambles. Will he win the scramble? Because Omar Gadjev has won each one so far. He's got the single. He pulls it in tight. That good work though from Vasiliev, who's working the elbows in, keeping his balance, making him work. But again, the takedown goes to Omar Gadjev. Good work and a great effort as he walked up the cage, backwards rolled into side control. Mm. 
Now Vasiliev works back to a full guard. He's got one hook in again. He likes that right foot on the hip. He can work control, keep some distance. He tries to push Omar Gadjev off. Omar Gadjev does seem to crowd his work. He holds tight himself. He's passed the side control. If he wants to work any power into the strikes, he has to get his head up and away from his opponent, Vladimir Vasiliev. There's one minute left in the second round now. So his head's clear, and there he goes, he pops up. I was gonna say his head's clear, he can pop up to strike, which he did. That time for the short elbow. Vasiliev working to get the legs back between them. And again, pushes off that hip. So again, right foot on the hip, trying to push off, trying to make distance, Vladimir Vasiliev. But Gadji, Omar Gadjev strikes, dives in to finish the round with a big right hand to the body. Always risky, but with seconds left, he lands a big shot. And really solidified that round for him. Again, I feel in that second round, he dominated the strikes, dominated the groundwork. Look at this positioning early on. He got past the guard, pinned. And here, even with the good work from Vasiliev, it was Omar Gadjev who ended up in the better position. Finished with a big overhand right to the body. So there we see the strike, 70 thrown, 38 landed for Omar Gadjev, 30 thrown, 14 landed for Vasiliev. He's got a lot of work to do for me. Vladimir Vasiliev needs a finish in this round if he's gonna win this main event. Gadjev, Omar Gadjev showing himself real championship material to me. Is he gonna get his 12th win out of 12 fights here as he shot for the leg straight away? Vasiliev trying to defend with elbows. He's looking for a Kimura here. Got the Kimura grip now on the left arm. Vasiliev does the right thing, circles round to that arm. Vasiliev still trying to pull the arm out. He's working for this Kimura. Kimura's a powerful grip he can finish from underneath half guard if he can get the arm out. But Omar Gadjev knows exactly what he's doing. He can also be used as a sweep if he can't get the finish. Using it to pressure. He's coming away from the fence now. Omar Gadjev getting his hand close to his hips and burying it in so that he can't move it. Again, that's the second time that the fence has been in the way to stop a sweep, and now it's allowed Omar Gadjev to get to mount position. Can he look for a finish now? He's two rounds up on my card. Well ahead on control, takedowns, and strikes. Can he get a finish, though? Good positioning. He's working the strikes. Switching from the punches to the elbows there as he's closer to the head. Choosing big shots. Vasiliev looks to lock up an arm and a head. Omar Gadjev is just all over him here, controlling the position as he moves from the back, moves to the front. 
He doesn't seem to mind where Vasiliev goes as long as he's in a dominant position and working away with his strikes. A real grinding kind of style. Inside control now. Looking to pin the arm. Two minutes left. What can Vladimir Vasiliev do? This is such a big fight for him. He's stuck underneath. He can't. He seems to run out of ideas. He's trying to bridge there. He's going back into that position. He doesn't want to get stuck, so he goes back to his knees. But again, put back to his back. Omar Gadjiev chooses to go into the half guard there. A great position for ground and pound because you're locked in. And it also shuts down his opponent using the shoulder in there. Tight positioning as he pins with one shoulder and punches with the other arm. We've got 80 seconds left in this main event of the evening. We've had 11 fights here. 11 fast-paced, action-packed fights. And this main event has lived up to all expectations because these are two finishing fighters, the known for fast finishers. But because of the standard, it's meant a long, drawn-out battle of takedowns, strikes, control on the fence. We've seen every single range, and we've seen high-level ability in all those ranges. But for me, Gadji Omar Gadjiev has just been that little bit better as Vladimir Vasiliev gets back to his feet. He works his way back to his feet. He's got 45 seconds, but that's a big takedown into a triangle choke. He escapes great transitions. Gets his hooks in. That was great work from Vasiliev. Still trying to win with a minute left. With now 30 seconds. Gadji Omar Gadjiev on the back of Vladimir Vasiliev working in strikes. He's got one hook in. He's controlling the position. Doesn't look like he's trying to finish as he pins down and just works the elbows. Sorry, it doesn't look like he's trying to choke is what I meant. He looks like he's trying to finish, but he's trying to finish with ground and pound strikes. Again, happy to go to the mount as long as he can carry on working strikes and keep control. And that was a dominant performance from the unbeaten Gadji Omar Gadjiev. Vladimir Vasiliev stayed the distance, stayed strong, took a lot of shots, kept trying, was still battling out. But we will hand over for the official decision. But on my card, that is three rounds and a unanimous decision for Gadji Omar Gadjiev. Гажи, поздравляю, ты сохранил свой рекорд с Ихим. Уверенная победа, ничего не дал сделать сопернику. Как сейчас? Гаджи, congratulations, you won this fight. Я приветствую всех, кто сегодня пришел сюда. Tell us about that. Спасибо вам. Thanks to all who came here. В общем, я чувствую себя хорошо. To support me, I am feeling well. Опытный был соперник. Ход молодой. I had a very good experienced fighter, experienced rival. Выше меня в этом матрице 121 что ли. He was in a good rating position in Fate Matrix. 
So uh, this victory gives me the opportunity to fight in Europe and after that in the United States. Okay, uh, what can you add to this? Can I take the microphone? Hello, everyone. Due to coronavirus, there are not many people here, but thanks to all who supported me, watching through the TV, through the internet, I'm very glad that you are with me. I want to dedicate this uh, victory to my coach who is experiencing tough times right now. Thanks to all who tries to develop this uh, sport. This sport. Thanks to all. Thanks, it was a good fight. А прямо сейчас приглашается наш партнер, дистрибьютор турнира ММА серии в мире, директор Лэш ТВ. Или давайте я вас послушаю. Мага Исма, я слышал, ты где-то в космосе летаешь. Магомед Исмаилов, я тоже прилетаю. I know you are in space. Once I will be there too. So see you in the airport. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. What a fantastic event we've had and a great win there in the main event. What an impressive fight to Gadji Omar Gadjiev working in, controlling the strikes early on. Then he got this takedown to the floor, controlled from the ground. Big right hand to the body. Just dominated from each position, every single range showing why he is 11 and 0 look at that takedown the trip lift up the single the trip and a dominant points win there